Rules by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can store a pattern layer in the libraries panel and also, of course, reuse it later. Now, here's the libraries panel. If you can't see that, it's window and libraries. To create a pattern layer, just go to a layer and new for layer and pattern. Click OK. Now, the designs I'm going to use, these ones are circles designs, a whole range of circle designs from a graphic extras, but you, of course, can use any other patterns as well. Click OK. Now, just simply select and then just drag over into the libraries. Now you see over there, you've got pattern fill one. Now obviously got a few test ones there as well, I created early, so got that still there. Now I'm gonna remove that. Now, if I drag that over back there, it's not exactly the same. Now you've actually just got a link back to this libraries. So if I just got that and I want to edit it, bring up layers, see, window and layers. If I actually want to edit it, what you have to do is just click on there, cloud, just bring into the, go into this PST file. Now what you can do, see you've got the pattern layer appears again. So that's the key thing. So you can actually just double click on that and then set that to 20. Now, the one thing about that is that if you save this PST file, and I'm just gonna quickly show you, just save that, save, and then that's updated. It's updated there as well, which is fine, but it's not really exactly what I want. I want to actually bring back the pattern layer. Well, to do that, I'm just going to quickly gain create a new layer and new fill layer and pattern. Click OK and just quickly create that again, just there. Drag over. Now, to actually resurrect that layer exactly as it was before, so you can use it exactly the same way where you've got the sort of scaling immediately available, just simply hold down the Alt. Alt or Option key and just drag that across. Now, exactly as before. So you can actually just go around and just go to the layers and you'll see then that it's actually things. So just basically select that, hold Alt, Option and just drag that and you've got the pattern fill exactly as it would be a normal pattern fill layer. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.